Okay, so you have all of your clips in order in a rough cut. And now what we're going to do is try to clean this up a little bit. I'm gonna show you what specifically is called L cuts and J cuts, but you can think about this uh, kind of refinement of edit process as blending your audio and video so you have a nice continuity. Let's just watch this real quick and see. It's, a, it's, it's nice, we got this audio track in. It's going, it's building up tension. Bad hits. We have a jump cut right there. This shot comes in a little long. And then we actually have Man, this shot I knew that test was gonna be hard. We have, I started... man, I te man, that test is gonna be hard. So, this is all nice, but watch what we can do if we start to unlink the audio and video and blend these clips together. First thing we're gonna take a look at is this shot's great, but then the bag uh, is right there. And it's, this one is a jump cut. We go from here, we just jump over the, uh, uh, the person right here into this one, right? Uh, so we don't really need this shot right here. We're gonna delete the shot. But what happens is if we have that now, we have, Man, I knew that just into right here. So what can we do? First thing we're going to do is take a look at moving clips around. So I'm going to take this clip right here and I'm going to just uh, com uh, command X, which is cut. I just cut it out for a second and I'm going to move this one down. So now we have this one reaching here there's a nice match on the action right here watch that boom. boom this hits right here so this all is tension that's building up where i can move these down and have this right so we have let me just clear this gap so now we have boom man i knew that test was going to be hard but I man I, this test is going to be hard how did he get there? Well, this is where L cuts and J cuts come into play. Minus sign to zoom out. I'm going to move all these clips down for a second. And I'm going to command V, paste that shot of Jonathan right here. So I'm going to have this shot going while hearing this clip. How do we do that? I'm going to take this clip right here, right click and unlink. Minute that you unlink that clip, we are able to then peel back the audio or the video from a clip. Here's another little pro tip. If you hold command, you can also do this without unlinking. So if you hold command, that's going to peel back a clip too. So I'm gonna peel back that clip a little bit, then I'm gonna come over this one and I'm just gonna overwrite this audio right here. In fact, we don't even need this audio right here. Right click, unlink, and take that out. So, I'm gonna bring this down. So now we're going to hear this clip over this clip. So what do we have? Man, I knew that test was gonna be hard. I studied for so long last night and still don't think I came anywhere close. So it allowed August to get to that point where he threw the bag and now he's on the ground. This cutting shot, that's why cutting shots are important. We were able to escape that because we didn't exactly match on the action. So now we were able to escape to this shot. So uh, just to recap, and we can put some like uh, graphics right here, for instance, um, to the graphics are put your playhead wherever you want it bring your type tool, start to type, and then you have essential graphics over here. Uh, essential graphics, you can uh, start to move things. You can align things, so centered right here, and then center, centered vertically right here. Change the, the font right here, for instance. We'll just go to Chalk Duster right here. And so now we have this. Man, 
I knew that test was going to be hard. I studied for so long last night and still don't think I came any. And that's really good. So just to recap, if you hold command, you can peel back uh, portions of things. So hold command and peel back. If you right click and unlink, that's going to unlink the audio and video. Be careful though. If you start moving clips, everything's going to be out of, uh, of sync. Okay? So. Good luck with that, and let's refine our edits.